Hey guys. So that was, I have like the lamest, like, what do I call that? Like an entrance, entrance thing? I don't know. Um, so I thought I would talk to you about my favorite nail polishes, which I don't have any nail polish on now. It's kind of weird that I'm talking about my favorite nail polishes at the summertime um, when I don't have any nail polish on. And the reason why I don't have any nail polish on is because I ran out of nail polish remover and I have like pieces of blue stuck there and I'm just not a fan of that. So they're going to be bare for today. But um, yeah, and I look a mess because this is what the wind does to your hair. So yeah, anyway, um, I am going to get started. I have picked 10 of my, did I get 10? Yeah, 10 of my favorite nail polishes of the summertime and ignore this scar it's bothering me but I'm not wearing any foundation today because I was so hot and I was like Pfft. anyways um so yeah ignore that that's my scar it's all pretty anyways okay so um this is gonna be kind of like a funny thing because some of these nail polish brands I'm not a fan of and I'll explain that but so I'll just get started with that um the first ones I'm gonna talk to you about are the sinful colors and um, they're really pretty colors and they're cheap. They're like two bucks. And I need to sit up a little bit. I'm on my laptop because I was kind of just laying there, kind of like going to bed, kind of, but I'm just kind of bored and not. I'm tired, but I'm not ready to go to sleep. So I need a video. And I don't look the greatest, so I'm sorry. Okay, but anyways, the simple colors are really pretty colors and they're two bucks. They're like $1.96 actually. And um, if you're like me, I change my nail polish color like quite a bit. And um, they don't last you longer than a day, really. Like they'll just chip right away. So that's the downfall of these. But they're really pretty and they have a good color payoff. They just don't stay on very long. I even tried like putting like a base coat and a top coat from like China Glaze and OPI and it just doesn't help. So I don't know what's, what the deal is with these sinful colors, but they don't stay on, but they're really pretty. Um, so if you're like me, like I said, and you like to um, change up your nail polish quite a bit, then this is perfect for you. So um, first color is this uh, really pretty purple. It looks kind of pinkish um, on the camera, but it's um, purple. And it's called Dream On. Aerosmith here. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but it's called Dream On, and it's just like a deep purple, but it's bright. It's kind of like, like a highlighter, like if it was a deep purple highlighter. That's what it reminds me of. So my first one and then the next one is this Pepto-Bismol pink and I usually don't care for pink too much but um, I got this for my little goddaughter and she's cute and she like loves pink and it's uh, but I like it for the summer on myself too it's I like it more of like a toenail polish color rather than a, a fingernail polish color but um, it's called 24-7 like I said it's Pepto-Bismol pink and the next one is this really pretty shimmery like minty green um, and it has like pieces of like gold and silver glitter it seems I think this one's called mint apple and I'm proud of myself I pronounced the T because I'm from Colorado and everybody says that people from Colorado don't pronounce their T's and I'm getting a phone call I know it was my mommy she called me so I can't ignore my mama um, but what was I saying about this? Yeah, it has like pieces of gold and silver glitter and it's really pretty. I like it. My next ones are going to be the Pure Ice. And I think that the Pure Ice nail polishes are probably like the best drugstore nail polishes that I've that I've come across. Um, they have good color payoff. They stay on for quite a bit of time. And um, they last a long time. Like this orange one I've had for like two years and it's still really good. It's not even thick. It's like perfectly fine. So, I like it, and I think they're like two bucks or three bucks or two fifty or something like that. But so we'll start off with this orange color. This is a shimmery orange, and it's called Hot Tamale, and I love orange. It's a pretty orange with some gold glitter inside of it, I believe, and it's really pretty. I love this color. Then the next one is this matte yellow. I've been searching forever for a matte yellow that has a good like nice color payoff and this is it and I like it a lot um, it's called showstopper showstopper 
And um, like I said, it's a matte yellow, and it's really milky, and I like it, and I think it's cool for the summer. The next one is this pale, minty, milky green, and it's, I like this color. Obviously, I like it. I mean, if I'm telling you about it, I like it. It's called Home Run, and it's really pretty. I was, I was in search of, like, a really nice, pretty minty color, and this is, like, the best one that I've come across. And it's, like I said, they're cheap. I think, I'm pretty sure that they're 250 but I love this color. <clears throat> then I thought that I would throw in a glitter. And I think this glitter is so pretty. It's just gorgeous. It's called Endless Fortune. And it's this gold glitter. And it has um, small pieces of glitter and big chunks of glitter. And it has like diamond shaped multi glitter, multi colored glitter. Like the small pieces are gold, but the big diamond pieces like reflect like every color that you can think of. So I like that color. That's a wiener wiener okay the next ones are I'm not sure if anybody else would really wear these colors but um, well two of them but I'm not sure about the third one so we'll leave that one for last but this color it's by Salon Perfect and I think that these nail polishes are kind of expensive for me. but I think they're like what are they or maybe they're not maybe they're four dollars I think they're four dollars or they're seven I'm pretty sure they're four um, they're Salon Perfect and this one is like a teal color, like a legit teal color. It's really pretty and it's a little shimmery, but you can't really tell that it's shimmery. Um, it's called Gone Sailing, and I'm in love with this color. I've used this color quite a bit, actually, so that means I like it. And the next one is this highlighter, bright orange. I'm in love with this color. I love, like I said, I love orange. Purple is my favorite color, but orange is like my favorite color that I like to get for like accessories and like colors to like it's like my favorite color to like wear I don't know it's weird that's I don't understand it so don't ask me because I don't understand it but um this one's called traffic cone and it's a nice nice bright yellow and I'm I love it but these colors you have to have a top coat with them or else they don't look right they look kind of like just like you just painted your nail with a highlighter which I think that these are like a highlighter like liquid highlighter here wait that doesn't make sense either because highlighters are liquid anyways but I didn't say that erase um, yeah, this is my favorite orange. Then my next color, this is my favorite one that I have. I'm showing you, I was ready to talk about it. Um, everybody tells me that it's ugly. But I love this color, like, it's, it's a highlighter yellow, like, bright neon fluorescent yellow. I'm in love with this color, and this one's called Yowza Yellow, and I think this color is so fun. Like, I just love it. I think I'm going to paint my nails this color. Um, but like I said about the top coat, um, you can either put a top coat on this. Well, it takes like kind of a lot of coats, but they dry really quickly. And like for the, like this one, for instance, like I think I have a video where I have this yellow. I don't, I'm not too sure which video it is. Um, but I put like four or five coats and then I put a top coat. But I found a trick. If you put a white base under like a white like the matte white obviously would be matte. Well, there I guess there is there are shimmery whites, but yeah, matte white, and just do a thin layer of that. Like it doesn't have to be like completely opaque. Um, and then put these colors on top. You need like one or two coats. One you could do. It's one is fine, like more than enough. And then you seal it with the top coat, and it's awesome. Like this color is just so bright. I like love neon colors. You wouldn't be able to tell because I think in a lot of my videos I'm wearing like a black shirt, but I like love these colors. So get them now and I'm just kidding <laughs> um, but yeah let me know if you like these kind of videos uh, like this video if you think this is a type of video that you'd like to see more or you'd like to see less of if you think it sucks just be like dude it sucks no more or if it's like awesome just be like do it more um, but I think that's it and um, don't forget to check out my last video what was my last video I think it's the poison makeup tutorial I believe and don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching and have a good day or afternoon or evening night whatever the heck it is whatever time it is that you're watching this video make it good okay bye